than they said it would be. It was supposed to be uh, 77 today, but the forecast change went up to 83. So, but thankfully there's a breeze out here. There's the swimming area right there. A lifeguard dude up there. So, yeah, my plan is to walk along here to get some sun exposure. Because I am very white skinned and in the future I'm gonna be exposed to even more sun and my plan is to um, walk no more than an hour I don't have sunscreen on that's the other thing is I'm trying to expose my uh, skin to uh, some sunlight I know I'll get some vitamin D that way I have a week off work and I'm really happy about that and I'm looking to do some more free stuff. I don't want to spend a lot of money. If I get slightly pink, that's okay. But um, I'm wearing my hat, yeah, because uh, it's important that my nose and ears don't get too much sun. Ooh, that really went in too far. You are wet. This may not have been the best things to wear on the beach. I don't know, sandals. Now they are soaking wet. Nice waves. And this is a major shipping area, so you can see in the distance one of the cargo ships that go in and out of Norfolk, Virginia, which is a major shipping port. So that ship is heading outbound through the Chesapeake Bay, which is where we are. Eventually it'll get to the Atlantic Ocean, which is way over that way. Actually, it's all part of the Atlantic Ocean, but this is salt water here. And, um, yeah, I don't know where that's headed, but a lot of uh, ships go to China and all over the place from here. Um, a lot of coal goes to China and shipped out through here. Way across the pond you will find such strange and exotic places like England and Scotland and Wales. And uh some other parts of Europe. Yeah, that way. Cleaning off my feet. My sandals are horrifically and irreparably soaked. So, that was a bad idea to walk in the water with those. These are not beach um, flip flops. Well, they could be, I suppose. But I think these are going to take a while to dry out. Well, here's my present goal at this very moment is to see if... You know how your feet get wet and, and they're terribly covered with sand? If you run into the sand and then get in your car and go home and that kind of thing. Right now I am walking just beyond where the water stops and it's not, you know, dry, dry sand. It's wet here and I'm going to see if the feet will dry out a little bit before I put these wet sandals back on. No, that would just make a mess. I will just dry these out and then go to the car, bare feet, 
um, and see if I get less sand on these toes. But if you get sunburn easily, let me know if you have any solutions for that besides a big hat um, without sunscreen, you know, and, and what your limit is on sun duration. I know I will burn in an hour. That's just the way it is. So, um, yeah, I'm going to wear sunscreen when I have to. But today, I'm just going to be out here a short while. And uh, try and get my skin used to being uh, exposed to a little bit of sun. Even though I am a vampire. And I, I should be sparkling by about now. Am I sparkling? I am walking slightly faster than that ship is um, traveling there. Now what do you suppose lives in these little holes along the beach? What's your guess? Can't be snakes. And uh, looks like they've dug out. And I don't know if we have sea turtles that kind of launch as babies in this particular beach. They have them in Virginia Beach nearby. But my guess is... Well, you guess first. You know, you go, you go first. But my guess is um, little crabs. Well, YouTube buds, I made it home, and I did not get too overheated, so that's a good thing. Um, yeah, overall, it was a good walk, and uh, I enjoyed it. My first time on the beach uh, this summer, and. Um, from here on in, it's just going to get too hot for me, probably. <laughs> but if it gets to 80 and below, I will uh, probably take another walk on the beach. So, And then uh, later in the week, I'll do some more uh, woodsy walking. Uh, there are not a lot of parks around here, lots of beach area, but not a lot of trees. And George needs his trees. So uh, give a thumbs up if you like the video, and comment below, and we will see you next time. All right? Bye.